Cindy, wherever she is. Here I am. We're at the moment watching the christening video. Just checking that out. See John's decorating. Yep, I decorated the house yeah, since the last decorating. time you've seen the video. I'll just give you a quick whip round. Mm -hmm. um, excellent job. That's been sponge. That's very rich and everybody that comes nice. in compliment. Oh I have a good order. Yeah, wonderful it is, yeah. Uh -huh. well, this is the main living room. That's my Christmas last year. Room over there. This here's in the hallway, that's the front door there. There's just some pictures of Alan that we're having a war when he was a baby. Coming around here, it's a hallway. You've seen our bedroom before. There's a funny story in here last year because it's a water bed and it's a, uh, controlled by a thermostat. And Alan sometimes gets in the room by himself. And last year in the summertime, he came around and he actually got into the thermostat. We didn't know about it and he actually turned it up to the highest point. So we were in bed, just went to sleep, and I reckon I lost about three kilos. That night was I'd been in the sauna, the whole bed was absolutely soaking. That's me safe in there, see that there? Eh? Not many people know about that. Yeah, it's me safe, that's where I keep all my money. Off the business and stuff like that. So nobody know about it. So here we go. Through the house. This is the corridor area. Don't go into the kitchen. Into the kitchen? Don't go into the kitchen. So she's done her job. There you are. It's full of pots and pans and stuff like that. Well, I'm going to time to do the dishes this morning. It's still morning here. You know, it's looking out to the, the room here. Oh my Can't god. We? Look at that. Right? Yeah. Look at that. Right. There we are. There's a the thing. It's yeah, coming out into the main room again. You can see it's a big circle going all the way around. And what we do at night time when we play with Al, we we'll actually just run around the house about 50 or 60 time, times until he's absolutely tired and then we'll put him to bed. And there he is eating his, eating his cakes. He loves cakes. Right, coming through. There's a picture of my mum up there when she was in the car. Jumping for joy. Picture of Alan. I don't think we have got mine, we've got plenty of pictures of Alan. I decorated this whole house by myself about a year ago now, and it looks absolutely fantastic. Everybody compliments on it. This is Alan's bedroom. There's his cot. There's his, as you can see, he's, he's tidy just like me. He keeps everything in one corner. Alright, and that's looking out to the outside of a property here now. Well that's mine. Come on, that's his clothes cupboard. That's the thing I think that Sue sent with that. Alright, come around. Into the bathroom. Mirror tiles are put up the other, other month. There's the shower. This is coming up off into the back room. This used to be green, this back room, but I actually painted it red. And it looks fantastic, especially with the, the brasses up. There's a stereo unit. It's an old record player we got for $45, 20 quid. That's a board up there, done in copper. There's a fire it's on the day because it is absolutely freezing outside. Lo and behold, it looks like a nice summer's day. It's, it's getting warmer now, but this morning there was actually frost and ice on the, on the ground. It gets that cold up here because we're up in the hills. And this year's looking off into the kitchen. Alright, 
Now we're going into Anthony's room. And here it is, here's Anthony's room. I clean for, be honest with you, I clean forgot to put Anthony. Right, here we are. Okay, there's his little change table. That's his portable card. There he is. Hello, beautiful. He's not, oh, he's only just waking up. That big smile as soon as he wakes up. Hello there. Hello there. Aren't they beautiful? Yeah. How's it going? <laughs> I know what you mean by cute. <laughs> anyway. There we go. There he is. No, don't start crying in a minute because he's awake. And there's one thing he does love. He loves his bottle. And I've never heard a deeper voice in a baby in my life. He's got a real deep howl. There's one of his teddies all up on, a, on his window. And that's also looking outside. Just outside the house, there's the, there's the fireplace area. There's that red room where I showed you. There's Anthony's room coming out there. There's the patio doors Hello. coming out. Back the air conditioner. Hello. That's the barbecue. When Gary was here, <laughs> I've got a funny story about that. The first night we're going to have an Aussie Barbie here, and there was, there was a, ho a hole in the hose from the barbecue bottle, and we turned the barbecue on, and there was flames shooting everywhere. <laughs> so actually, we, it wasn't until about two weeks after Gary was here that we actually had managed to get a barbecue. But this used to be the main area, just here. We used to have tables and chairs here, and we used to get absolutely plastered just about every night. This has my fernery. This is where I keep all the ferns that go in the, in the house. And I'll just leave them out here and just for a bit of sunshine. I painted all this itself. Very nice. And now we're gonna come outside. This is the these are Alan's cars. And they are our cars. <laughs> uh -huh. There's Alan's bike. <laughs> and I've sold my bike. <laughs> <laughs> oh, big lad. Daddy's car's got a ding, hasn't it? It's got a ding, yes. It's mummy's car. Uh huh. Yeah. Yes, they're both done by daddy, I'm afraid. <laughs> uh huh. Oh, yeah, then. That's the, the office area. This here is really focused high. Should we wash your hands? Yeah. Oh, that's better. Yeah, we just focused right high. This has the office area. And I'll come in here. There's my telescope. It's a nice vase that we got from England. Some light conditioner in there. It used to be Gary and Lenny's room is when they first came here. There's our Collins pictures of Mars and Rock. <coughs> Pardon me, I've just had some coke. Um, there's a clear pipe collection that we had. Here's the little dolls my mum give you. Here's the dresser. That used to be my workbench when this was an office. And come on through and here's the bed in it. Right. There's a picture of the West Anetti. I don't think that's there no more, is it? Okay then, coming through. Oh, Alright. Let's have a look here. The fence in here, just close that door properly. Right. That's me shed, that's where I practice me karate all the time. I've got a bit of a twisted ankle right now. I've been practicing all these high flying kicks. 
There's the car. And there's all the bangs in the front of it. Can it be held, can it? Yeah. What you pay to the hazard of drinking, I think. Right, into the shed. There we are. Going up through here, nice big shed I've got, as you can see. Okay, there's my punch bags. There's all my gardening tools. The whip I snip that pepper driven one. Uh -huh. And I'll get up there, get on a punch bag and get all my aggressions out when I can. Oh beautiful, you in here as well? Uh huh. You get some toys out, are you? Okay. Are we going to get the rake out? Are we going to do some gardening, are you? Oh, no, don't hit me. Oh. Fair enough. Oh. Ow. Okay, Alan, stop hitting us. Right, that's the karate jacket. Well, at least one of them offered heaps of karate jackets. Alan, come on, son. Hey. How are you? Come on, let's go outside now. Come on. Me dartboard. Got to get some practice in for when I'm back in the tune. How are you, big lad? Oops. It's a nice warm day getting now. It was freezing this morning. There was actually ice on the, on the floor here. As you can see, this is the back of it. Okay. There's about a thousand trees on my property. It's one and a quarter acres big. And what's wrong? What are you crying for, Alan? What have you done? Oh, it seems to be a bit of a hoof, I think. What's wrong? Alan's just gone in to the house there. Right, that's my little plant box there. Those are two freshwater tanks. They hold about 8,000 litres of water. And I've actually got fair fresh water throughout the house. You have to have that up here. I've got mains water, but the mains water absolutely stinks from the reservoir up the road there. And it's not very nice for drinking. And if you have a bath in it, it's, the bath water is actually brown. You come up with a tan. So I keep all my, my cuttings off my trees and all that and I use it for firewood. And those were my chicken pens at one point. Now the I just that's for storage for my firewood. And the other one is because I've got rid of them all now, but I actually used to keep budgies and birds and them particular ones. And I should say and I used to keep a rabbit and guinea pigs and them bat ones for that. But I had some friends around going back um, just before Christmas this year and <laughs> one of the children got in there and the whole, the whole property was covered in rabbits and guinea pigs and birds flying off all over the place because they let the doors open but oh, it was just, that was the end of that <laughs> these are the sheds here, these are more chicken sheds some ducks I used to keep in there as well the whole ducks and chickens just have free range of the whole property. There we are. The big enclosure there. The boundary of me property is actually that back fence there. Them trees are around the back of my property there. And I'll show you the the other area. That's the the boundary line where them trees are there going all the way down and that's the back of my house and that's that big shed that you just had a look at I've just been standing over there talking to you all right just give you an idea where you are there's the cars there okay and she has the other side of the property come around there are fruit trees and almond trees and all that and this little garden area comes all the way around up until that back part of the fence and that's that enclosed area there. That's my compost heap, that's where I put all my cuttings, put my compost up around 